Good day, friends. How are you doing today? Let's make it another awesome day today. Let's make it another fantastic day today. I am feeling awesome today because I am meeting you again, friends. We are doing this again. How awesome it is. Today, we are going to look at the power of discipline. What is it? Some would say it is not a good thing. Some would say it's a way of punishing a man. Is it? I would say no. I would say it is a good thing. It has helped me a lot. And if you can reflect your back at some point or the other, definitely this has helped you to achieve what you want to achieve. I guarantee. And let's discuss your things in detail in today's video. Friends, for example, what are you doing when no one is watching you? Let's say you are studying for your, for your degree. Let's say you are, you are studying for your next exam. And are you looking for your parents to get disappeared, to do something else without focusing on what you are studying, without finishing it? If you are doing that, if, if that is your intention, then I would say you don't have a discipline. But the friend is, it's a choice. It's a choice. Having that discipline or not, as a human, it's a choice. But as we have discussed in some other video, if you, have, if you really have a purpose for doing what you are doing, and if you really have that end game in your mind, if it is, if it is a kind of a fantastic end that you are, you are having, and the fantastic goal in, in your mind that you are having, that you are, that you are, that you are targeting, that you are reaching, and if you are doing something to get you to that point, and that would help you to have that discipline to you, to you, with you. It will help you to have that focus with you. So friends, let, let's let's uh, let's uh, let's take another example. Uh, in, in in my world, when I'm when I'm preparing when I'm preparing for these videos, I really should have a discipline to focus on the contents that I'm preparing. And I really have a purpose of doing this, a big purpose behind it, because I want to help everyone, you to thrive and you to achieve what you want to achieve with 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 these with these videos as well. So friends, but still sometimes I would I would lose the focus sometimes. But I have a discipline when I realize when I when I lose the focus I realize it as soon I lose it. And what I will do is listen to this carefully. This is a small tool. What I will do is I will simply stop what I'm doing. I will take a deep breath and I will realize why I'm doing this. What's the purpose behind it? And that helps. That gives me energy to bring back my focus to what I was doing. And then I will continue for the next a couple of hours maybe with that discipline. And that helps me to finish what I want to finish. And friends, you can remember I told you, you know this and this must have helped you at some point for sure. This is the next example I'm going to discuss. This is about kids. Some would ask me, can we really teach discipline to kids? I would say yes. But before that, let's let's learn from them. We can we can learn the discipline, especially from babies. And at, and at this point, uh, I would I would uh, really apologize if this is going to disturb you in some or the other way. But I'm just bringing this as an example from which we can learn. When we look at babies, have you ever seen a baby who's, who's having the potential to walk? 
it's not achieving it, it's not getting there. No. They would somehow do it. One day they would walk. And and my friends, I have seen this personally with Anina. And I guarantee you everybody must have seen this in your own life, with, with your own experience, or with someone someone else's experience. And what they do, what do they do? Every day they don't give up. Every day they try. They have that discipline every day, my friends. Every day they they, they try try to do it, try to do it somehow, and they get there. And that's the discipline that we want to bring to ourselves. That's the discipline that we want to integrate with ourselves, my friends. If we can do that, and I guarantee those chunk of disciplines that we are bringing into ourselves will help us to get there. It will help us to get where we want to be, where we want to go. And on the other hand, friends, why it is very important is sometimes you may realize, oh, what's, what's the first point? Let's say, let's say we are, we are studying for an exam. And, and sometimes you may think, oh, what's the point? Like, let's say I'm, I'm, I'm going to just, just not do it today. Let's, 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 not, let's, let's not do it for one hour and let's do something else that I really, really um, uh, wanted to do in that hour. And, and, and I'm not going to lose anything today in that one hour. Some may think like that. But my friends, what we have to realize is those others are adding up. And if we have such indiscipline hours adding to ourselves, little by little, it will bring a disaster. It will bring a disaster. So my friends, on the other hand, if we bring those discipline hours more and more to ourselves, that would help to finish what you want to finish in that hour and such accumulated disciplined hours will bring you the success my friends and my friends now we have a choice you have a choice i have a choice in front of us whether we should integrate this good habit to ourselves or not i wish you will have the courage to realize the importance of this and integrate that to yourself and i guarantee that in that discipline would help you to achieve what you want to achieve and for you to thrive and i wish you all the very best friends a good day great day and i wish you a fantastic week ahead